Fleet Week 2023 kicked off last week with the ceremonial parade of ships into New York Harbor. That's right. Some of the military's most impressive ships are on display, including the USS Wasp, a Navy amphibious assault ship that is occupied by both the Navy and the U.S. Marine Corps. This is a live look from Sky Fox. You can see the ship there. Fox 5's Regan Meji is on the USS Wasp this morning and joins us now with more. Good morning, Reagan. Good morning, good morning. If had I known where the uh, Fox 5 helicopter, I could have given you a little wave. Yeah, this is an impressive ship. Uh, we are in front of an Osprey, and this is also an impressive aircraft. And to explain it even further, I'm joined now by Marine Captain Jeffrey Comrie, who is one of the pilots of the Osprey. Good morning to you, sir. Good morning. Good morning. Glad All to right. be here. Oh, we're glad that you are <laughs> here. So now explain to me what an Osprey is, because it looks like a hybrid between a helicopter and an airplane. You got that right. <laughs> it's a vertical lift and takeoff airplane, essentially. It has the ability to rotate these engines backwards. So when we apply the power, it can come up off the ground into a hover. And then for forward flight, we just transition. We move them forward, essentially. So they rotate forward, and this thing just takes off. There's a tremendous amount of power, a lot of speed. We have the ability to essentially hover like a helicopter, land anywhere, anywhere it'll fit, and fly really fast, really far. Now, of which, course, I asked you, can we uh, do a demo? And he said, oh, no. So we can't just, do that. <laughs> you can paint the picture for me, if you will. As best as I can. <laughs> like this, like this, yeah. and then like this. Yep, All right, so uh, part of the Marines. The Marines also work in conjunction with the sailors, not the soldiers. Soldiers are Army. Sailors Correct. with the U.S. Navy. Correct, yes. Okay, so we're going to go actually inside because oh, uh, when we were touring this uh, aircraft before, I thought, wouldn't it be neat to show people exactly what it looks like? So you see the outside of it. Now, watch your head. Ha watch your head. All I need is for Al. And Al, watch your, Al's my cameraman, and so is Lauren. So watch your step here. We're going to, I'm going to kind of back up and kind of show you. Uh, if you happen to, I don't know, look at any military aircraft, I know the, the oil over here. Uh, you can see all of these little seats here. My dad was um, a paratrooper for the 82nd Airborne. So, um, you know, if he's watching right now, he understands what this all looks like. It's kind of like a, let's say a jump seat. Is that what these seats are called? or? Yeah, something like that. We actually do uh, drop. Uh, uh, paratroopers out of the back of this. Too. Oh, you do. One of the My many, one of the many mission sets that we do. Can you imagine jumping out of one of these things? It's crazy. I'd much rather be flying. Oh yeah. Well, kudos, kudos to those guys that do it. <laughs> right. So now, how many um, now Marines uh, or paratroopers would? How many could get kind of fastened into here? We can carry. We typically say we carry about 24 fully combat loaded Marines. Okay. So now, what's the purpose of transporting the Marines or other sailors or soldiers through a, an aircraft like this? So the mission is assault support. So. Uh, and with this helicopter aircraft, we have the ability to transport them tremendous distance uh, over the horizon warfare, essentially, is what we're doing. So our mission is to, in this case, move them from, like, the ship, the LHD, the WASP, a uh, long ways, say like 800 nautical miles, or even further if we air the refill, and then drop them into an austere location where they uh, get out and go take uh, seize the objective, essentially. So I know you had mentioned before people say, oh, where are the, where are the missiles, where are the bombs and this thing, and that's not the case. Not the case, it's a assault support aircraft. So it's, uh, it's primary, it's, it has a defensive weapon system on the back, like a mm -hmm. 50 cal machine gun. Mm -hmm. um, but our primary uh, uh, weapon system is speed and evasion. We're very okay. fast, very nimble. Okay, so I know you know people are probably watching, and maybe there's an aspiring marine out there. Uh, what what was the decision you had that aha moment where you said I want to be I want to be in the Marines and I want to be a captain for an Osprey? I was always so impressed with the, the Marines I knew uh, growing up through uh, high school and college. Uh, honestly, I grew to envy them and their mm -hmm. experience. Um, and I got the opportunity. Uh, I met met some people, uh, and they said, Yeah, you know, you should give this a shot. And I uh, started looking into it. Um, I always wanted to fly. I always <laughs> yeah. wanted to be a Marine. And I got super blessed. I was able to put the two together. So, That's beautiful. So okay. Incredible, incredible ride. Well, we thank you for your service. And I only have 30 seconds, but he needs to know. This was his first trip to New York City. See that smile on his face? It's good you time. can't hide that. Oh, I'm sure it was. You can't hide that smile. So what did you do while you were here? Keep it clean. Uh, I saw the 9-11 Memorial, Liberty Tower. Got to have dinner on the uh, observation deck of Liberty Tower. That was... <gasps> Incredible. I yeah. haven't even done that. Uh, that was incredible. Um, got to go to uh, Statue of Liberty, Ellis Island. Uh, How was that when you saw Ellis that Island? Was, that was moving. Yeah. I, uh, I was moved. So many of us have come through that. I mean, my family has through yeah. Ellis Island. It's unbelievable. Actually, I found some relatives. I believe the relatives on one of the placards out there. So I'm asking well, family right now, 
Do you know these people? This is very like their family. So oh. it's, it's a powerful moment for me. I can I can imagine. Well, this is a powerful moment for all of us here and the viewers at Fox 5. Uh, we have to unfortunately <laughs> wrap it up. I can talk to you forever about this. But thank you so much for your service, Captain Comrie. I really appreciate it. My pleasure. Thank, thank you. Thank you. Back to you at the studio. God bless America. Yes. yes. Absolutely. <laughs> Absolutely. And, and Reagan, I got to say, that backward waddle and those tight quarters, it's quite impressive. What Reagan was doing? Yeah. No, yeah, she yes. was, you know, Is it, you, didn't you do, trip. You do often see those vessels from the outside, and you never actually get a look inside. It's it tight. You see it there. But it's impressive. Yeah, yeah. All Great. right. Two dozen uh, Marines, wherever they have to go. All